Automobile are common and necessary goods used by millions of people every day from one point to the other, either for traveling, running errands, commuting to and fro, etc. Based on 2019 statistics, China remains the world's largest producer of vehicles, manufacturing over 21 million cars and 4.36 million commercial vehicles. Nigeria, with about 200 million population, is one of the African leading consumers of automobile goods, as the demand is at high. In his personal effort to launch Nigeria among the emerging automotive manufacturing hub, with determination to create job opportunities for Timmy youths and increase in Nigerian foreign exchange Henny, Prime Mustafa Haudu, a Nigerian inventor, a manufacturer of KMBC motor vehicles has unveiled made in Nigeria electric vehicle into the market. KMBC Motors Vehicle Manufacturing Company was founded by Nigeria born politician, philanthropist, and entrepreneur Prince Aldu about three years ago and set the record to be the first technology company to manufacture various electric cars and vehicles in Nigeria. Speaking shortly after the official presentation of this Made in Nigeria electric motor vehicles to the Honorable Minister of Science and Technology for endorsement, Chief Ogunaya Ono, Prince Aldo narrated that the idea and the entire manufacturing design of the vehicle was conceptualized by him and was done with the intention to make life meaningful for Nigerians. He further enjoined Nigeria government to channel necessary funding toward the initiative as any investment made on this project is capable to boost the country's gross domestic product GDP. Vehicle in Nigeria, vehicle producing companies. So we would like government to look at this as a project that is beneficial to all Nigerians. Um, the Senate just approved 4 trillion naira for subsidy. This money can go into production. We can create a lot of jobs. We can create a lot of employment. That's one of our young electricians there who, you know, is employed through this. We have many other people that would gain employment. Um, we have a small factory. We have a small um, assembly area, you know, so we're looking to expand. We're looking to make this production time for this takes me about three and a half weeks to a month, you know, with the proper technology, with the proper funding that can come down. The prices too can also come down. I've also tried to apply for a pioneer status. I just met the Minister of Science and Technology who is helping us out with the pioneer status, so I'm very grateful to him. Um, there are a lot of eco funds, green funds that are available. We make climate compliance, so any help from government, any help from donor agencies will be great. We're scheduled to meet the Minister of Youth and Sports. This is a very encouraging next week. So we hope that that goes well. We hope that my governor, which is the Kogi State Governor, intervenes. This is something that is very beneficial for Kogai to create a lot of jobs. If we have the first major factory established in Kogi State, it will be a thing of joy to Kogai to be a thing of joy to Nigerians, you know, and it gives that sense of pride, that sense of belonging, everything Nigerian that we make. A lot of people, we've seen a lot of people, every day they see this, they come around, they pray for us, they, they thank us, you know, they encourage us. So uh, it's not um, what we expect from government, but we're grateful that government is starting to pick up the pace. So we hope that a fund is created that would encourage us. This can create millions of jobs. The value chain of this is tremendous. We can be producing the glass in one company, the, the fans in another company, there's still another company, the mirrors. There's so much technology infused in this. There's reverse camera, Bluetooth, MP3, MP4, MP5, IoT 5.0. IoT means Internet of Things. Communicate, meaning that if you have a fleet of this, it can tell you where all your vehicles are. It can tell you the battery level of each vehicle. It can tell you what specifically you need to know. Another thing that has always affected Kekena Peps is that it's always open, open to rain, used for committing crime. As a display, this is the, the gear. So that's on drive, then there's neutral and reverse. Then as for AC, if you want AC, that's the AC vent. That's the fan if you're on fan. That's the fan, that's the light. All LED, energy efficient. So that's it. That's what you have here.
electric motor vehicles from KMBC Motor Manufacturing Company are environmental friendly motor vehicles that have modern facilities and sophisticated interior components to give both the drivers and the passenger maximum comfort while on transit. Tolulokwe Oludayo reporting for Newsporter TV.